So uh, for those of our members who don't have uh, uh, don't have an opportunity for a variety of reasons to join Zoom or uh, who can't come uh, at this specific time, uh, there is a chance to follow up on YouTube. You don't get to hang out with with others in the breakout room, so that's a downside of YouTube. But uh, but it also is a great opportunity for us to have a little record of what's been going on. So, Shabbat Shalom, everyone. Um, let's do this. Find a person on the screen that you recognize and wave at them. Um, I, now find the person that you don't recognize and wave at them. You know, the amazing thing is it looks exactly the same. You're just waving at my end. How cool is that? Really excited to see all of you. We have some special visitors. Uh, our second graders are going to be sharing uh, their, their special Shabbat presentation with us and their wonderful teachers as well. They're very excited. There we go. There's uh, more Orin and more Sarah is somewhere there as well. Um, I, I haven't oh, seen her yet. Okay, very good. So Shabbat Shalom. Uh, now it is um, wonderful to see all of you. It is wonderful to celebrate Shabbat together. It is still 2021 and it is still pandemic, which means that we can't really safely be in the room, all of us together, crawling all around uh, and jumping and singing and dancing. But you know what? We can still crawl around and jump and sing and dance and be excited about the fact that Shabbat is here um, because you can do this in your own home. Just stay with the camera on so that I can see you. And the same goes for singing. We love to sing a Temple Emmanuel, and unfortunately we can't harmonize with each other, but it doesn't mean that you don't get to sing. So you guys get to harmonize at home, and uh, the more people you have there, you go ahead and you sing, and if you are great at it, fantastic. And if you think that you're not particularly great, doesn't matter. It's great. You know, no one, no one is going to judge you. Well, no one will ever judge you at Temple Emmanuel anyway. So uh, we are very excited to come together for Shabbat and begin, begin singing. Hava, Hava, Nashira, Shir Hallelujah, Shir Hallelujah. Shir Hallelujah, Shir Hallelujah. Hava, Hava Nashira, Shir Hallelujah, Shir Hallelujah. Hava, Hava Nashira, Shir Hallelujah, Shir Hallelujah. Hava, Hava. Shabbat Shalom, everyone! So wonderful, so exciting to be together with all of you um, and to sing together, even though I know, I know, we can't quite all uh, all sing together, but what a wonderful opportunity to see each other singing. Uh, it certainly gives me a lot of joy. It makes me feel like you are all there, but you're all in the front row. So you see, one thing that nobody has heard me say in almost a year now is, come on, don't sit at the back, come forward, because everybody is in the front row. How cool is that? How cool is that? Hinne matovu 
ומנעים שבת אחים גם יחד. הנה מה טוב ומנעים שבת אחים גם יחד. הנה מה טוב שבת אחים גם יחד. So, if you are home and you have somebody there with you, I want you to turn around uh, and welcome them and say Shabbat Shalom. And maybe shake their hand or give them a hug or be excited. Now, I want you to find somebody on the screen that you don't recognize, that you don't know. And I want you to uh, click on their name and send them a chat and wish them a Shabbat Shalom in person, in private, and introduce yourself. <clears throat> I know, usually we do this uh, in, a, in a little more personal way, but that's, a, uh, that's still a great way to welcome someone and get to know some people. Bim, bom, bim, 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 bom, bim, 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 No cheating, don't send messages to your friends and family. Find somebody you don't know. Bim, bom, bim, bidi, bom, bim, bidi, bim, bim, bom. Shabbat shalom, shabbat shalom, shabbat, 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 shabbat shalom. Shabbat shalom, shabbat shalom, shabbat, 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 shabbat shalom. Shabbat 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 Shalom Shabbat 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 Shalom Shabbat Shalom Shabbat Shalom Shabbat 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 Shalom By the way, I love the on-screen clapping. Bim bom bim bidi bom bim bidi bim bim bom chidi bidi bidi bim bom bim bidi bom. If you have your candles prepared, we are going to light them and welcome Shabbat into our lives. We don't have one, we have two. In fact, you can have more than two, but it's a minimum of two candles that we'll light when we welcome Shabbat because in our tradition there are two different commandments that we hear. One says Shamor et Shabbat, that you should... Shamor, Lishmor, is from keeping, protecting. And the other one says, Zachor et Shabbat, remember Shabbat. And our tradition in Lechadudi, we have this phrase, Shamor ve Zachor bedibur echad, that both Shamor, to, to observe or keep, and to Zachor, to remember, they were given, that God somehow managed to give them to us in one word, in one commandment. But the humans, our language, couldn't handle the both concepts in one, and so we ended up, with both Shamor and Zachor as two separate words. And so in recognition of that, we have the two Shabbat candles. So go ahead and light them if they're not uh, already lit. And we'll join together with a blessing. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech Ha'olam asher kidishanu b'mitzvotah V'tzihivanu Lehad Likner, Lehad Likner, Shel Shabbat. Shabbat Shalom. Lechu Nera Nena, Yain Ain Ain Lana Haila, creation for 
from mountain to sea. Hear our song. Let me let up and now. Nai, 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 nai. God's light, we rejoice. So now let us listen with all of our heart to hear God's voice. stone for the righteous and gladness for the upright at heart. Or Zarua Lad Sadiq Uli Shre Lev Simcha Or Zarua Lad Sadiq Uli Shre Lev Simcha Or Zarua Lad Sadiq Uli Shre Lev Simcha Shrei lev simcha, or zaru ala tzadik, uli shrei lev simcha, uli shrei lev simcha. Ya na 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 na. Now we will be talking a lot about Shabbat today and of course welcoming Shabbat both with ancient psalms and with modern stories that our students will tell us and of course with the words written in the 16th century by the Kabbalists in Tzfat, Lechadodi, welcoming the Sabbath bride. Lecha Lechadodi, Lekrat Lekrat Kala, Pene Pene Shabbat Mekabela. Lecha Lechadodi, Lekrat Lekrat Kala, Pene Pene Shabbat Mekabela, La 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 I love the animals dancing. Remember, Shamor Vizachor, remember and keep. Shamor Vizachor Bedi Burechan. Kishmi Anu Ela Meyuchad Adonai Echadu Shemo Echad. Leshem ulti feret velit hila la 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 kadoti lekrat lekrat kala bene bene shabat mekabela lechal kadoti lekrat lekrat kala bene bene shabat mekabela. Lekrat shabat lekuven elcha. Ki me kora beracha, merosh mi kedem nesucha. So pa ase be machshavat hila la 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 kadoti lekrat lekrat kala. Penei penei shabat nekabela. 
Shabbat, of lehodot, la Adonai, ulezamer le shimcha elion, ulezamer le shimcha elion. This morning, le yom hashabbat, of lehodot, la Adonai, ulezamer le shimcha elion, ulezamer le shimcha elion. Lehagid ba boker chazdecha. celebrating Shabbat, but this is not just an ordinary Shabbat. It is our family monthly service, which is super exciting. But it's not just an ordinary family Shabbat service. It's the one where all of the second graders get to show up as well as their teachers. So I'm going to invite Oren and Sarah uh, to share with us while I am switching to, ooh, to something that they have prepared. Uh, I'm going to invite them to unmute themselves and to tell us a little bit about their class and what they've been working on. Hi, right, everybody. Um, for those who don't know me, I'm Sarah. And I'm Oren. We're both the second grade teachers this year. And we just want to tell you guys a little bit about what the class has been doing this year and just about our amazing students' work. In the beginning of the year, we learned a lot about Gimilut Chasadim or loving acts of kindness. We learned all about lessons in the Torah that show giving Luke Hasidim as well as examples in our own lives. So although this year has been very different than most, um, we are still so, so impressed 
with this great group of kids and we're so thankful for their amazing parents that are always there to help them and get them there on time. So we really appreciate it. So we have tried to keep running the class the same way as usual, even though it has been a little harder online. So we usually start the class with a little intro, trying to relate our bigger topic to kind of our own lives so the kids try to understand it better right from the start. Then we usually read a short story or a description from our workbook and discuss what we read. And then after that, we usually have some kind of activity, which is a matching activity or pulling in a graphic organizer or having a little drawing activity. So as you'll see on the screen, this is one of the crafts that we recently worked on this past Sunday. And the topic was, what is our favorite thing about Shabbat? So they all came up with these really great ideas and it really brought out their creativity and their very dedicated art skills. So each student will now have a chance to share their favorite part of Shabbat while we show their picture that they drew. Oh, so okay, so I need to, you know what? I'm going to let everyone, uh, okay. So when, when, you, when you appear, when your student appears on the screen, would you please unmute yourselves and have them tell us, Sasha. Sasha, you're up first. I like when I get to spend time with my family and friends during Shabbat. Good job. Beautiful. There, there we go. And you? I like to light the candles on Shabbat. I like to spend time with family and friends. That looks like a lot of fun at that table. Eli was not able to join us, but he said I... that he really likes challah because it tastes good. And he drew a really nice picture for it. You know, Belarusian and me saw this and thought potato and then, oh, challah. <laughs> Go ahead, I'm going to talk. Turn your thing on. Mine is my favorite part of Shabbat is the challah. And as you can see, I did that description, but I needed help by a book to see the description. And you see, that's enough salt. Oh, because my, I always put a lot of salt, but my mom doesn't like putting the salt on the challah. So she's like, that's enough salt! It's been here. I don't know if I saw him. But I'm pretty sure his is a picture of being with friends and family. Um, and he is here. He said he likes to drink grape juice and eat challah on Shabbat. Sounds like a good activity to me. We say hamost hamotzi on Shabbat. Very nice, saying hamotzi on Shabbat. Very good. Okay. Ready? Here you go. I like Shabbat because the oh, yeah. right <laughs> <laughs> challah. All right. Good job. I think that's the last one, right, Rabbi? um well, let's check yeah i think that is that is indeed so, wow thank you guys so much for sharing with us uh, all of these wonderful things that you love about shabbat and of course a huge thank you to our fantastic phenomenal teachers who have uh, time and time again figured out a way to uh, continue to engage with their students um, despite the fact that um, not able to be with them in the same room uh, not something that is quite easily achieved so call a kavod to you and to all of our wonderful students who have been learning about shabbat and what do you know right there in our service <coughs> there is also a reminder to us that we should keep shabbat and observe it and celebrate it with challah and with juice 
maybe wine if you were grown up, and with a little salt on the challah, but Emma just a little salt, and maybe with honey on challah, but only on Rosh Hashanah, although Emma told me earlier that she's not a big honey fan, so uh, I don't know. We can, we can argue about that. And, of course, the time spent with family and friends and a little learning of Torah. Uh, what a wonderful celebration it is. Veishamru v'nei Yisrael et ha-shabbat Lasot et ha-shabbat ledorot ha-berit olam Veishamru v'nei Yisrael et ha-shabbat Lasot et ha-shabbat ledorot ha-berit olam Bein yuvein Bnei Israel, Bnei Israel, Hodi leolam. Bnei Shamru, Bnei Israel, et Hashabat, Lasot et Hashabat ledorot haberit olam. Ki sheshet yamim, Hasadonai, Hasadonai. את השמיים ואת הארץ ושמרו בני ישראל את השבת לעשות את השבת לדורות הברית עולם וביום השביעי שבת ואי Shabbat Vainafash Shamru Vene Israel together on Shabbat, we not only have a candle and do the blessing for Kiddush and Challah, but we also uh, think of those who struggle perhaps with an illness, uh, who's not feeling well. And uh, this is the time when we think of our loved ones and family and friends. We have a lot of people on our list. And if there are some names that did not make it onto the list, you can put them into a chat and we will add our prayers for their health as well. Tonight, we pray for health of Greg Evans, Ruth and Peter Lanzer, Stuart Engar, Martin Lifshitz, Megan Gleason, Nada Ottenstein, Stephen Golub, Rita Sachs, Louis Gordon, Marvin Lang, Shol Guerra, Sonia and Don Noyes, Alan ben, Alon Ben Rivka, Yona Ben Mine, Yitzhak Herschel Ben Meir, Mark Levine, Sabrina Selfridge, Nick Randall, Pat Servone, Ruth Handler, Robert Healy, Doug Randall, Jay Sokolow, Susan Walton, George Zimbel, Judy Goldman, Wendy Hoser, Joyce Hoser, Yefim Krieger, Elena Berger, Mitch Broder, Anne Rack, David Chaim Ben Pinchas, Irene David, Steve Schiff, Bruce Feldman, Michael Sachs, Harold Stern, Arlene Hirschfelder, Ruth Scheinfeld, David Pellet, Leben David Ben Chaim, Shoshana Batzerela, Steve Goodman, Tzvi Ben Dina, Ruchel Bela Bat Shmuel, Paulette Marcus, Frank Alvarado, Pearl Rosner, Carlene Wagner, Mayor Ben Gittel, Yechel Shaul Ben Rachel, Harriet Lieberman, James Murray, Kathy Langston, Hannah Bella Batlibi Cecil, Rachel Perlman, Sue Daniello, Sharon Rocha, Anna Whitker, Randy Sobelman, Natasha Larkin, Walter Sofian, Eliezer Ben Sarina, Doug Stacy, and Gary Teller. And uh, I see that there's uh, there are some additional names people have been putting into chat. Um, Sidney Shambrom, Dave Knight, Stuart Koritsky, Jeff Riederman, Marion and Do Bob Drobish, Roberta Vine, Pascal Panza, uh, Abdul Muhammad, uh, Sam Levinson, Nancy, uh,
Diana Adams, Bobby Wallace, David Salm, Sue Kaplan, Uri Koenigsfeld, Bernie Apteker, and Barbara Miller. Baruch Ata Adonai, Rofe Cholim, blessed are you Adonai, who sends healing to those who are in need of healing. <laughs> Please heal this soul. Mishabera Avram Vesara Itzhak Verivka Yaakov Rachel Velea El Narefanala Fua Shlema El Narefanala Please heal this soul With faith and love Together we bring Hope and healing To those in need Without judgment Without explanation We are all God's creation El At this point in our service, uh, we usually come to uh, telling a little story and sharing perhaps a book. And this uh, this week, since we are talking about Shabbat, I wanted to share a, a story and a book, which is actually um, quite remarkable. Where Olga reminded me that this is based on a poem that we know from uh, from our childhood it's a it's a russian poem but here it gets to play out about shabbat so what's not to like i think it's quite special and i'm just going to figure out how to show it to you so that you only see the screen hmm. okay well that's the best we can do okay here we go so uh, usually at this point, I invite all of the students to come up uh, and sit up front uh, so that I can tell them a story. And the grown-ups, well, you guys get to listen in. <laughs> of course, um, it's a little easier because everybody gets to sit in the front row now, right? So if you want to, to get down and sit in the carpet, you can do that too. And the story today is called The Cricket and the Ant. A Shabbat story. On Sunday, la li la 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 la, the cricket chirped in the town square. On Monday, chit chat chit chat chark, the cricket warbled in the park. On Tuesday, oh how very sweet, tra la la, tra la la, trilled in the street. On Wednesday, diddle dum diddle dee. He leaped and danced along the sea. On Thursday, yoppity yippity yop, he sang and played at a nearby shop. The week had been busy with singing and fun, and Cricket was tired from all he had done. So on Friday morning, he opened one eye, just one. Oh, it's too early, he said with a sigh. I'll sleep a bit longer, and then when I wake, I'll bake for Shabbat a yum yummy cake. He woke a little later, a bit later, just one hour more. He said in the voice that turned into snore. Then he woke with a start and a sprang from his bed. He stared at the clock. Oh, where was my head? 
It's late afternoon, I've no time to waste. Shabbat's coming soon, I must bake with haste. He rushed to the pantry, then gasped, oh dear me. There was nothing, no crumb, no food he could see. He dashed to the fridge and picked in, but once more there was nothing inside when he opened the door. He searched all the cupboards to hunt and to check, but the, his whole house was bare, not one nibble or speck. The cricket was stumped. Now what can I do? There's no time to shop for more groceries, it's true. So how will I make my grand Shabbat cake? Could I use some fine sand plus some drops from the lake? Then he sniffed at the air. Hang on, what's that smell? Something yummy is baking nearby, I can tell. Someone is making a cake while I can't. It must be my hard-working neighbor, the ant. So the cricket went knocking at his neighbor's door. Excuse me, but could I just trouble you for one small spoon of sugar? I'm baking, you see. At least I will bake if there is sugar for me. Thank you, dear neighbor, he said and rushed back. But then in his kitchen, oh no, now I lack. Knock, knock. Hello again, aunt. I'm back, if I may. Neighbor aunt, just one more, I must beg. Oh, uh, did I miss some words? Ah, there you go. I'm back, if I may. Can you spare me a droplet of oil today? He bowed to the ant. And then he hopped and rushed back. He entered his kitchen. Oh no, now I lack. Knock, knock, knock. Neighbor ant, just once more, I must beg. Could you spare for your neighbor just half of an egg? Thank you, dear ant. You're a good neighbor indeed. He rushed to his kitchen. Do I have all I need? Knock, knock, knock. Sorry, I just need some flour, a bit. A handful, a pinch. Yes, thank you. That's it. The ant heaved a sigh, but then said, Indeed, it's pleasant to help out a friend who's in need. Then the ant, in her chair, lay back, closed her eyes, just as the moon was beginning to rise. But what, you may ask, of her wonderful cake? Did she turn off her oven? No? What a mistake! All of a sudden, she gasped and awoke. The kitchen was filled with a gray cloud of smoke. She glanced at the oven. Her stomach had turned. Oh, no. Her Shabbat cake was totally burned. Her table was set with wine, red and sweet. The candles, the challah, but no cake to eat. And sighed, and sighed, and she felt that her heart just might break. For how would she welcome Shabbat without cake? Indeed. She tasted some soup, took a sip, took a bite. She chewed and she swallowed with no appetite. When all of a sudden, knock, knock at the door. Who could it be, she thought, crossing the floor. It's the cricket, all smiles, and what's on his tray? A cake for Shabbat. For his most for this most special day dear neighbor said cricket as he pulled out a chair i've baked us this cake that i hope you will share side by side at the table the cricket and ant clink their glasses together lechaim they chant they sing and they dance and their joy has no end let's welcome shabbat with the ant and her friend now um I know that we can't really pop over to our neighbors with a baked cake, not at the moment. Well, maybe we can drop off the cake uh, if we're baking, but we still get to celebrate Shabbat with our immediate families and we get to use technology to widen our family group a little bit so that we can celebrate Shabbat together with each other, with other members of Temple Emmanuel uh, and um, additional family and friends. I know that many of us have been Many of you I know have been meeting with your friends and family uh, using all kinds of online things. So that's really exciting. And this is what we're going to do. We are going to sing and dance a little bit more. You guys ready? 
Okay, I'm especially looking at grown-ups because I think you've done some cool dancing today. What an amazing dance party this was. I loved seeing that. Okay, now, as we uh, prepare to finish our service tonight, we uh, think of those whose yard sites um, occur at this time uh, to support each other so that we are able to say Kaddish together. Tonight, we remember Samuel Botwin, father of uh, Susan Sharnoff, Marilyn Brand, cousin of Larry Eisner, Sadie Brown, grandmother of Laurel Shader, H. Marvin Daskal, uh, father of Diane Rubin, Sylvia Eagle, mother of Norman, Golda Fardman, my grandmother, Molly Freed, um, mother of Diane Erica, Cynthia Gimbel Babick, uh, sister of Betsy Ratner and aunt of Howard, Sharon Rosenthal Handler, wife of Larry, Nate Corman, uncle of Stephen Fine, Faye Levy, mother-in-law of Ed Cantor, Matthew and Ryan Marcus, sons of Brad and Paulette, Helen Schwartz, mother of Ronald, Emmanuel Schaefer, father of Lou, Philip Sobelman, father of Barbara Larkin, and Gussie Zuckerman, grandmother of Phil Pivauer. We also remember those who passed away in recent weeks and months. Sylvia Abrams, Hyman Gluck, Norbert Eglosh, Miriam Ratner, Nancy Suckman, Susan Mingione, Des Fleischman, Ruth Rosenthal, Milton Woke, Pat Valente, Selma Fishkin, Talma Fenichel, June Gordon, Trina Cohen, Harold Eichler, Mitch Fleischman, Israel Weiser, Lynette Bletchman, Renee Lifschitz, Ted Rashovsky, Fred Candioti, Harvey Cedarbaum, Harriet Schachter Alfieri, Norma Botwin, Mehdi Stusnik, Celia Gordon, Marcia Sabbath, Annette Elstein, Joan Small, Dan Brown, Bernard Singer and Mac Hargrove. Is there anyone else here observing a yard site? And I see people have been putting names into the chat. Give me one second, I'll get to those. Uh, Lynette Bletchman. Okay, N Nicole Loban, uh, <laughs> Esther Lieberson, uh, Orange Fire Marshal Tim Smith. Uh, Alinda, were you, were you adding something? No, 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 that's okay. I saw my mom's name. Okay, yeah, yeah, no, her name was there. Yes. All right. Zechar um, Tzadik Levracha, may the memory of righteous endure for a blessing. May comfort come to all the mourners as we rise and say the Kaddish together. Yid Gadal, Vid Kaddash, Shmei Rabba, Ve'alma, Divra, Chiruute, Ve'yamlich, Malchute, Ve'chai Chon, Ve'yom Echon, Ve'chai Dechol, Be'i Israel. Bagalau Vizman Karif Vemru Amen. Yehe Shmera Ba Mevarach La Alamu La Alme Almaya. It Barach Vishtabach Vit Baar Vitroman Vit Nase. 
Vid hadar, vid ale, vid halal, shmedi kutsha prihu. Le elam in kolbir hata ve shirata, tushbe hata ve nechemata, da miran bi alma ve imru, amen. Jehe shlamara ba min shmaya, ve chaim aleinu ve al kol Israel, ve imru, amen. U se shalom bim romav, uya se shalom, aleinu ve al kol Israel, ve imru, amen. Please be seated. We continue now with uh, our announcements. Shabbat Shalom and a welcome to all visitors who are joining us today and to all of you. Tomorrow morning, Shabbat morning minion at 10 a.m. Everyone is welcome to join for our informal monthly Shabbat service. The next TE Art Walk will be on Wednesday, February 10th with Lori Freed and Karen Sabbath. The TE Diaper, Diaper Drive is on and runs through February. All the details can be found in the Shofar Blast. You may contact Rochelle Connell if you have any specific questions. Also, Abraham's Tent is ongoing, and we are helping to house the homeless this winter. All the info can also be found in the Shofar Blast, and you may contact Barbara Levine Ritterman or Lee Stoltzman for additional details. Jewish Family Service is starting a new virtual support group for adults who are grieving the loss of a spouse or significant other, and that will begin in February. Please speak to Rabbi Farbman if you would like additional information. All the details of all of our events and programs are available on the TE website and in your weekly email Shofar Blast. Are there any other brief TE-related announcements? The, the Beckerman Jewish Film Series uh, have uh, started, and uh, if you if you click on the link in the show for blast you will see uh it is done uh, a little differently uh, this this year but you can watch uh, movies from the comfort of your home there are multiple movies that will be screened between now and may and there'll be some discussions uh that'll be organized uh, for various sections of this it should be it should be quite special so uh, if you haven't checked it out please do thank you so much michael Right now, um, <clears throat> I know uh, I can see some of you have prepared your kiddish cups. I have mine, so we are going to make kiddish now because Shabbat is here. So we have we have done the candles, we have done a little singing and dancing. Oh, I love that indigo and sage. They come with their own. Uh, that looks like a like a teacups there, but very good, very good. I love that. Very creative. Vaihiarev Vaihivoker Yom Hashishi Vaihulu Hashama in the Haaretz Vehold Seva Vaihalohim by Yomashvihi Malach to Ashera Sa Vaishbot by Yomashvihi Mikol Melach to Ashera Sa Vaivare Helohim at Yomashvihi Vaikaha de Shoto Kivo Shabbat Mikol Melach To Asher Bara Elohim Lasod Baruch Ata Donai Eloheinu Melech Haolam Borei Peri Hagafen Baruch Ata Donai Eloheinu Melech Haolam Asher Kedishanu B'mitzvot Haver Atzavanu Veshabbat Kodsho Be'ahava Uvratzon In Chilanu Zikaron le ma se vere shi, ki u yom te hila le mi krahe kodesh, ze her le tsiyat mi tsraim, ki vanu vacharta, veotanu ki dashta, mi kola min, ve shabat kotcheha. Biahava overatson in Haltanu Baruchata Adonai Mekadesh Hashabat Amen Lechayim. Now, are there any birthdays? that we're celebrating in February. Are there any kids with February birthdays? Did I miss someone there? Do we have any birthdays this month? I know, I know that we had, um, 
uh, I think, was it Eli? Was it Eli's birthday? Yeah, it was Eli's birthday the other day, and I'm not sure if somebody else. So you know what? Just in case, uh, I don't have the list in front of my eyes, but for all the kids and all the grown-ups that are celebrating their birthdays in the month of February, let's sing together. Yom Oledet Samech, woo! Yom Oledet Samech, Yom Oledet Samech, Yom Oledet Samech, woo! Happy birthday! Upcoming or recently celebrated. Um, very exciting. Now, what we're going to do now, uh, and don't run away if you don't have to, uh, we are going to do what we love uh, so much we're going to visit with each other and wish each other Shabbat Shalom. So if you don't have to run away just yet, um, I'm going to stop sharing uh, my screen and I'm going to stop our 